Hi, just a quick second channel video just to show you a problem that I'm having with uh, both XSplit and DaVinci Resolve, which I'm, I'm still learning DaVinci Resolve and I'm doing uh, most of my new videos in there, at least the, the relatively uh, simple ones in it, and it's, it's okay for the most part, but this is the first time I've tried a 4K video, not only in DaVinci Resolve, but it's also the first time that I've done a 4K screen capture. Now, um, I'm using XSplit for my screen capture. Always have, yeah, yeah, OBS, use OBS, use OBS. I use XSplit, okay? And um, 4K screen capture, I've never had any problems with it. Always do my talking head screen captures with uh, at uh, 1080p, regular full HD. But anyway, so I'm gonna, this is gonna be a single take video. Now, I've got my, one thing I found is that A, DaVinci Resolve <laughs> is only playing back my audio through one channel. I have no idea why. I have no idea why. I, it's, it, like, I, it normally only shows like a single um, waveform like this, so I don't know how dual channel works. Or I've, I've never had to dick around with it. It's just worked. Um, but anyway, so that's, that's the first problem. See if it does it now. Point out to our DAC. Yeah, out here. You you uh, won't be able to hear this. You can't oh, do multiple maybe you can. Level It'll be feeding in. Undo. But I can only hear it through one anyway, channel. Anyway, for those who don't in know, fact, all of these I, wiggle traces yeah. here, these right. are of turned course, off, and it should now. So I don't know if it's coming about, through on uh, this, but I, I can't going hear anything. Uh, DDR now. memory these days, so in this case, go into yeah. the uh, <laughs> DAC. Uh, then, and it's only coming yeah, through one channel. But if I replay that 4K screen capture from XSplit on VLC, that goes all. Shut up. If I replay it on um, XSplit, uh, sorry, if I replay the XSplit vid the raw XSplit video on VLC, it comes out both speakers. So I don't know what that is. Um, I don't know if it'll render on a single channel. I don't know how I'm going to fix that. I if, if it does, I don't know. But anyway, that's problem number one. Second problem is more bizarre. I've never encountered this before. Over here, right? I was, I was editing like this, and audio's in and sync to my going video. Out to Listen. Our DAC. Out here. Right? Audio is uh, in sync to the video. And then I found right at this point that it suddenly became out of sync. Like out out of sync by in, in this case you can see that I had to actually I've actually manually offset this by like 0.2 of a second. And it's not a slow drift out of sync either. It is a hopefully it hasn't happened on this 4K screen capture video that I'm doing right now. Uh, well, hopefully it maybe it will. <laughs> in that case, sorry. Um it, it's just suddenly jumped by like 0.2 of a second. So I have actually corrected it here. All of these wiggle traces here. That's not these too hard, but watch this. If I go to the next clip, length. which is so only a short about, trim uh, in the there, there was a bit of um, dead space. Memory Listen, these watch. Trace that goes all the way on oh, the no, outside. Oh, no, 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 I fixed that one else. too. Um, no, that's fine. It matters once but you get this one over speed. here, once so again. I'm not actually sure what kind of speed uh, this memory would be operating here. Hang on, at it's working on me now. It's making a full full out of me. Hang on. Yeah, so I'm not sure what here we go. speed the memory Look. speed uh, this memory Look. would be operating it's in sync, here right? at he yeah. Somewhere in here it goes out of sync. Watch. Yeah, so I'm not sure what uh, speed the memory would be operating there. You'll See, guess, it's, it's, it's out of sync, and that's the same. That's the one continuous uh, clip from there to there. It's the one continuous thing. All of a sudden, it ju it was in sync here. And then it's out of sync here. And then if I go over here, it's even worse. E Once again, same clip. Here, that's a dual 16-bit, 250 meg sample uh, per second attack. So as I said, yeah, it's <laughs> One of those pretty, badly uh, dubbed quick. movies. And then they've right? uh, just it's got way out. It's way out. And then if I keep there, going they, and going uh, and going, it's, it's your, uh, horrible. By the time I get to the um, end of output, this... Uh, crystal there and aha uh -huh, there's your video connection that's on the Look. bottom side of the board there you can see some uh, talking but my mouth ain't going length, uh, traces going on in there um, as well and then you've got all uh, series what? resistor terminators what? so that's yeah there's got a, so I'm I don't, gonna, uh, get I don't know what the heck what external is going on there I got no idea if you know um, <laughs> leave it in the comments down below but yeah anyway this is a pain in the ass I'm not going to reshoot this I'm just going to have to Trim it, and and the jumps seem to have happened in these silent periods here. These silent periods is where it seems to make the big jump for some reason. Uh, I don't know if it's like 0.2 seconds each time. I've only taken out one of them so far. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have to resync up all this audio, which isn't hard in uh, DaVinci Resolve. So yeah, so that's not a problem, but it's really annoying. <laughs>
I just can't cop a break, you know? So, I, unbelievable. Yeah, yeah, being a YouTuber, it's a pain in the ass. When you touch anything, everything, you know, like I decided, oh, yeah, I'll do a 4K screen capture with my talking head. And I'll, you know, on my 4K screen, because normally I'm looking this direction on my 1080p screen. No, I got to had to move my camera to do the 4K. So I went to the effort and then all of a sudden it's all out of whack. I don't know if you ever seen that on OBS as well. Um, yeah, I just... XSplit, nothing's changed on XSplit, except I'm doing a 4K recording, which I don't think I've done a 4K desktop recording. Oh, no, I might have. I think I've done it once, but I don't think it was long like this one. This one's quite long. This is a 20-minute uh, clip or something like that, So, which I, you know, trim down. There's little pauses and things in there as I go get data sheets and, you know, whatnot. Um, and, but, yeah, it's... A, I don't know. It's If you've got any clue what's happening. But, obviously, I'm not going to... Uh, record 4K using XSplit anymore, which is a bummer. I have to go to OBS, I guess. I'll have to try that. Need to do some experiments. But anyway, that is thoroughly annoying. And sorry if my... <laughs> this is a single clip. So if my um, audio is out of sync now, then you'll know, yeah, something's gone horribly wrong. But that's really annoying. That's today's challenge. Anyway, thought I'd do a you know, quick, easy video. Nah. <laughs> Catch you next time.